Hey everybody, uh, I'm Chris from Arch Enemy. And I'm Michael, and uh, we're basically here for this magazine, Guitar Part, and uh, we're going to show you some stuff of our new record, Rise of the Tyrant, so stick with it and uh, check it out. C'est à Paris dans les coulisses du Bataclan que les frères Amot, Michael et Christopher nous ont accueillis à bras ouverts pour une masterclass mémorable à deux guitares. Riff après riff, ils décortiquent pour GP, Blood on your hands, extrait de leur septième album. Yeah, so that's basically um, a pull-off thing, and we, you know, like that. Mm -hmm. that's yeah. Basically. And I'm doing a uh, uh, harmony on that, but I use the open strings as well. So. So it's kind of a. I harmonize some of the notes. All, all except the open strings, it's kind of a Phrygian harmony, a uh, Phrygian scale with thirds in harmony. So, you want to play it slow? So it's kind of, uh, sounds a little bit, uh, I don't know. Oriental or something. Exotic. Bit. Exotic, maybe. <laughs> it looks cool as well. You just kind of like, you know, pull off stuff looks cool. So it's a good thing for the show. It's first first riff, the first song on the first, on the new album, so yeah. So that was like the main riff of the song, it's in A, and uh, pull offs again, and it's important to mute the, the A string, but mm. keep the D string. It's important to keep it separate between open and mute. Yeah, you need definition of those notes, like this is more just a sound, you know, and uh, the on the A string, and then the notes are on the... Uh, yeah, and then there's a little... Yeah. A little squeal at the end. Yeah. That's it. That's kind of the verse. Verse part, but yeah. the vocals kick in, so yeah. It's got a cool groove to it as well. The drums are pretty cool on that. So. Yeah. That's the verse. So that's basically um, pre-chorus. Pre-chorus, yeah. So it's kind of simple. It's just power chords. Just kind of moving around. It's, um, and then we do this little harmonized part. We like yeah. to do that a lot. We kind of har harmonize little parts of riffs just to give it a spice it up. Yeah, spice it up, basically another dimension. So yeah, it's got a which is uh, yeah, that's part of it. Third harmony again. Yeah. So uh, yeah, and then it goes into the chorus, which we're going to show you now. So that's like the chorus basically with the vocals. And the chorus is in two parts. It's got a, um, the next part has kind of got a melody on it, no vocals. So this is the first part with the vocals and we're kind of basically harmonizing the whole way, right? No, just no? parts actually. Parts, and parts again, yeah, certain notes, but, but it basically is like. So uh, we, 
This is pretty tricky for me because I like I'm skipping over these two. It's easier for me because I wrote it like this and then I asked Chris to do the harmony so he has to do the hard work, figure out the positioning of the... Yeah, but I'm still returning, I'm playing the same uh, basic... Yeah. But I'm just gonna... Yes. So lots of little harmony spots. Very important. Yeah, you don't want to be like... One thing when I started playing guitar, it's like difficult to get like certain stuff to jump out, you know, to pop out certain notes, you know. It's kind of all in the in the, the little the, this fleshy part that you have here, you know. You kind of you you move that around depending what kind of sound you want. It's all stuff that you learn along the way. Yeah. That's the second part of the chorus, which has like this mel melodic theme, and uh, I'm playing the melody, uh, and Chris is playing the chords, and the chords are basically what we were showing before, but a different phrasing, which you can show me. Yeah, it's just a regular chugging rhythm. You know, I'm using a lot of, uh, I'm using the wah pedal here as well, as you might hear, um, which I do a lot on uh, melodies and solos and stuff like that. It makes the, uh, I like that tone and it's what I like to do. Cut it's through. kind of, ex yeah, it cuts through and it's kind of expressive, you know, you can do, like I do a lot of, uh, you know, um, um, so I kind of, as I'm bending, I'm also uh, doing um, this motion with the wah, which is kind of, you know, so yeah. Yes. That's the second that's the chorus. <laughs> so basically that's a harmonized uh, little thing. Kind of a yeah, we do it after the solos. You know, we usually like to do that. We do a duo. I do a solo, Mike do a solo, then we go together and play something in harmonies. Yeah. So it's just, um, I don't know how we came up with that. It's kind of a unique chord sequence for us, I guess. Mm -hmm. But you know, it's always good to be original. We always try to, you know, do something different, so. It sounds great like when you, you go together and play something loud because obviously both guitars are usually playing very heavy rhythms and one's playing solo. But when you go, both go together and, and play like stuff up here, it's kind of... If you're in tune. If you're in tune. Can sound, yeah, not so good if you're not in tune, you know. Good stuff. So that's the harmony part. Solo, most interesting part now. And uh, I still. So I have an open string uh, kind of lick. Um, I still have a. 
Sometimes it kind of emulates a wah sound. I, I hit the toggle switch, so I like get that kind of swell. So that's, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Uh, the rhythm behind it is kind of the it's the but it's you know, from the pre-chorus, but uh, it's moved down to uh, the E string and it's got a. Uh, it's got like a... So you're kind of opening it up on that. And they dampening hard on that, so you get that... Very accentuated. So that's what's going on behind the, the solo, pretty much. Cool. Short and sweet, that's the solo from um, um, Blood on Your Hands from Rise of Tyrant. So it's, uh, but what Chris is playing, the rhythm is basically. It's kind of the pre. No, the, the chorus. Mean? The chorus, yeah. Yeah. And then, uh, but it's. Yeah. The same thing twice. Yeah. And I basically started the solo on the, again using the wah pedal to really make the notes sing. And I go um, on the 22nd fret, I'm like. That's basically it. So it's kind of like a melodic thing again. With some. Um, oh. these kind of pauses. It's kind of a, uh, just a feel thing. So basically that's it. And then the next part after that is actually the one where we go together and do the
Yeah. <laughs> well, that was that. Now, hopefully, you've got a little insight onto what we do with uh, Arch Enemy, Michael and Christopher Amon, and uh, it's basically a lot of little things. Little, you know, we've been playing together for a long time, so it's kind of little things you develop, like a little signature sound. And um, yeah, hopefully you got a little peek into what we do. That was uh, Blood on Your Hands from Rise of the Tyrant. Yeah, use your ears. Use you know? your ears, yeah. Listen to what you're playing. <laughs> Have so, a little, uh, stay metal.